I literally need to sit down for this one because I just, I don't comprehend. Hey everybody, welcome back. My name is Nicole and if you are new here, there is a red subscribe button down below. Make sure to click it and give this video a thumbs up so you are notified every single time I post a new video. And I know the last time I said this, I, I complained about Jake Paul, but this one, it just really, like, it dumbfounded me. Like, he's a moron by himself, but his fans are even bigger morons for this. I mean, I'm not gonna do the whole population of Jake's fans, but at least the two, three thousand that showed up to his freaking little Harvey, uh, Hurricane Harvey support thing that he's trying to do. So, backstory. Jake Paul drove 20 hours with three of Team 10 members from LA into San Antonio, Texas. Uh, their their hearts are in the right mind of wanting to help. I know people have been saying that they like Keemstar. He says that he's gonna help, but he's gonna wait until after the floods and all that has been taken out. That way, he's not in the way. If something were to happen, then he's taking resources away from the people that actually do need it. Um, everybody's different. I'm not gonna knock on anybody for choosing the way they want to support. Jake's Paul posted this on social media saying he's looking for his fans to help to donate water, pillows, and whatever just other, so, like other needs that people in Texas would need because they've lost everything. It, great idea. He rented two U-Haul trucks and told everybody to meet up at Walmart. Now his fans, which another, somebody on Youposted the video and I'll link the full video down below and just this is a clip that I've taken out of the video. We drove 24 hours straight just to help you. Back please, up, please, please, please. Go guys, keep it back up. His fans showed up, according to the person that posted this, 50% of the people showed up without anything to donate. They were just there to meet Jake Paul. And you can see throughout the videos and some other videos that I saw as well because it was recommended in this video thing that I was watching. Um, people were just standing there trying to take pictures. Jake had to get on the truck and tell everybody to calm down. Supposedly people were getting into fights. Uh, people were getting injured. Cops showed up. Fire rescue showed up. They shut down this Walmart. Like, I get it. It's, it's your idol. But nowhere on the stupid little post thing did he said he's going to physically stand there and meet all of you. He was there to collect donations. Um, you're 12. Most of you are 12. Most of you are whatever. Y'all don't understand the how a hurricane is or being affected by a hurricane. I live in Florida. I get affected by hurricanes all the time. 
but like this I just are you dumb like I, I don't understand again back to the parents parents taking them to go to these things first of all it's not a meet and greet like I said it was to donate so people were there Jake had to get on to his car and tell people to, to stop like if to move and nobody listened they shut down this Walmart like it's just so so many wrong things another thing I don't understand is Jake got on top of his truck and started yelling to 2,000 people first of all if you watch Jake videos if you watch his Instagram whatever you know his Tacoma truck or what yeah, it's Tacoma his truck is modified so he has a loudspeaker why didn't he just use a stupid loudspeaker and say hey calm down and everything that he said in the video um it just common sense and another thing is I'm, I'm not sure how much I'm showing on this video or how much I actually did show because I'm uh, whatever editing um people were jumping on his truck what in the right minds makes you think that it's okay to jump on the truck and the jet skis that he rented and people were falling off and just kids kids do not think i i don't get it i don't get it and of course i'm pretty sure that if a jake pauler finds this He's gonna write hate comments down below. Oh well, y'all are idiots. Majority of you are idiots. It's a fact. It's proven. I mean, Jake's an idiot as well as we've seen the past two months of him and all this stupid shit that he's been doing in LA. But I, I guess it's monkey see, monkey do. I just, I, I don't know. I just, just a public service announcement. If it doesn't say meet and greet, it's going to help at least show up with donations and then mob it but he couldn't even get all the donations on the truck from what I've seen and from what I've seen on Drama Alert and from other videos and stuff like that. Like, I don't know, man. Instead of trying to resolve one issue, it just created a whole nother issue with people getting injured and like some other people saying, that they took it as a, a like a, a, celebrity, a, a normal meet and greet it wasn't i think i've said that like 20 times already i just i can't comprehend what goes through people's minds especially little kids i mean kids are kids but parents oh my god um that's pretty much it for now i'll do another video eventually if he does something else stupid which i'm sure he does and he will and Let's see if he actually does save anybody because I know he runs a jet skis and God knows what he's gonna do with the jet skis. But let's let's see. Uh, it is what it is. <laughs> Bye guys.